Hi everybody, are you ready for a story? We're going to read The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. So I hope you're all sitting comfortably. Grab your favorite teddy and a cushion. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. Can you all see the little egg? One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple. On Tuesday, he ate through one, two pears. But he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through one, two, three plums. But he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through one, two, three, four strawberries. But he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through one, two, three, four five oranges but he was still hungry on saturday he ate through one piece of chocolate cake one ice cream cone one pickle one slice of swiss cheese one slice of salami one lollipop one piece of cherry pie one sausage one cupcake and one slice of watermelon and that night he had a stomach ache. Oh, poor caterpillar, he's eaten too much food, hasn't he? The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better. But now he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and what happened? He was a beautiful butterfly. Look at all those lovely colours. Wow. I wonder if you will see any butterflies when you look out of your windows today. Have a look. What do you think? And all those lovely colours, look, and all those holes that the caterpillar has nibbled through our book. And that is the end. I hope you enjoyed the story, and I might come back and read another one another day. All right, see you all soon. Bye.